Now, if you'd like to ride the waves instead of the ramps, our viewers say La Push is the best place for surfing, which is also the best place to get a taste of our next winner, the best winery. Here's St. Brian. Megan, this is Esquin Wine Merchants in Soto with 50,000 bottles of wine, the largest selection in the Pacific Northwest. But even here, you won't find anything from our winning vineyard. That's because they're kind of a mom and pop operation that goes by the name Westport Winery. Ten miles from the waves of Westport, a lighthouse signals it's time for a toast. Okay, cheers. At Westport Winery. This is the chocolate raspberry wine. Year round, owners Kim and Blaine Roberts welcome visitors to sip the fruits of their family farm. And they're all Washington State. We're simple farmers. We want to go out, pick that grape off the vine, and then drink it in the glass. Back in 2007, the Roberts purchased 22 acres of overgrown land off of Highway 105. So overgrown, they uncovered a long forgotten bulldozer rusting in weeds. They farmed with dreams of making wine at Washington's only vineyard by the sea. Of course, everyone thought they were crazy. Everybody, Everybody did. said we were nuts. Not anymore. Today, the Roberts, along with their daughter Carrie and son Dana, make more than 20 different wines, many of them award winning. Mmm, delicious. All have clever labels and names like Surfer's Last Syrah and Bogberry Blush. We also try and associate it with the various charities. We give a portion of the proceeds of every bottle to a local charity. So I guess a really good example would be Shorebird Chardonnay benefits Grays Harbor Audubon. And a Rapture of the Deep benefits one of our local theater groups. Outside their tasting room, the Roberts show support for area artists by showcasing sculptures made in Washington. Anyone on their way to the beach can take a stroll around the garden and right into the tasting room. Cheers. Just look for the lighthouse, a beacon of good times ahead at Westport Winery. If you've never been out to Westport Winery, it's kind of fun. They have flocks of chickens, irises, beehives, and of course, wine tasting every day from 11 a.m. to 6 p.m. Megan? Thanks, Saints. Not a bad assignment you got there. Hey, congratulations to the Roberts as well. They just won three more awards at an international wine competition. Some good stuff there in Westport.